I'm here in Harajuku, which is the heart of Japanese youth fashion, and it's insane. What, what do they call this? Saibaku. The cyber look is just one thing the kids here are into. You look gorgeous. <laughs> Thank you. Everywhere I look, people are pushing fashion boundaries. How brilliant! They say trends aren't followed here. Thus started. Japanese fashion expert Yui Moritani is taking me on a fashion voyage of discovery to the center of it. So can you tell me about Harajuku and what happens? How does this happen on the weekends? Uh, weekday, they can't do um, pretty fashion because uh, they have to go to school, they have to go to work, but we can, they can wear crazy. So it's just anything goes here. And, yeah. it's, and it seems to be a place where you come down and just really show your individuality. And everywhere you go, there's something cute. Yeah, they like uh, cute things. Whatever floats your boat, you can find it here. So let's give it a go. Mm. I'll go dress up. Yeah. Japanese youth have radically embraced anime characters and Western caricatures. Any look that you want can be found here. Punk never dies. It exists right here in Japan. Fashion is a way to stand out, but their fondness for being cute goes to extremes. What age group is the Lolita? Any age is fine, for example, 50. 50? Uh, yeah. Great, I qualify by just five years. You can wear as you like, so we, we don't have rules, so you can make rules. I love that about Japan, it's amazing. It's exciting. Lolita's come in four styles. Gothic, sweetie, pop, and me? I'm choosing a classic. Where does this go, around my leg? No, oh. leg, Teresa. <laughs> Choker. <laughs> okay, shall we try this on? Don't laugh. <laughs> All right. <laughs> I'm gonna come out and milk the cows in a minute. Okay, ready? Yeah. This is amazing. <laughs> This is my Lolita outfit. Does this go like this? Yeah. Just to finish Lolita off, we've got a teddy. <laughs> How fun to be able to get lost in this, this world of fantasy and expression and being an individual. <laughs> I'm getting right into this dress-up culture, and in Tokyo, there's a place to do just that and capture the moment on camera. Right, we're going to go for the onesie look, maybe. <laughs> this is so ridiculous. But at least I get to experiment with the makeup. Who needs anti-aging cream when you can put love hearts all over your wrinkles? <laughs> I'm Rachel Hunter. I grew up in the fashion world. Now I want to see what beauty means to other people. I'm embarking on a journey around the world to discover the secrets of lasting beauty, great health, an extraordinary long life. From different parts of the world, I want to find the secrets.